Where can you go to see the wizarding world of Harry Potter, Miles of Minion Mayhem, and the streets of Springfield? Universal Studios Hollywood. Fans can step inside the magical world of Hogwarts, take the flight of the Hippogriff, get outfitted with a wand at Ollivander's store, and be spellbound by the students of Hogwarts Frog Choir. If you ever wanted to visit Springfield, USA, here's your chance. I mean, we're actually kind of bringing the land to life because it's actually, you know, it's an animated cartoon, but we actually dimensionalize it and kind of bring it to our reality. When we first started the project and we decided to have the nuclear towers there, it just didn't make sense to have the nuclear towers without making them explode. There's art on the walls, actual hand-drawn characters from the actual animators from the show. You won't see that anywhere else in the world. Minions are, are very captivating. And one of the things we wanted to do over there was actually make a land out of it. So we recreated the neighborhood, and part of what we try to do in making things very immersive is add little extra fun things to discover. The doorbells, you walk around through the neighborhood, you can press all the doorbells. Different sound effects come from each one. Super Silly Funland, the theme park that grew and the kids visit in the film, is brought to life at the park. Because before he's kind of a bad guy, he's just kind of taking advantage of him. But in that moment when he's at Super Silly Funland, he emotionally connects, they do the face painting thing, he comes home, he's all excited, he's actually found love. And so that's why it was very, it was kind of a touching ode to that, that actually create that here.